Good day everybody, welcome to part 4. In this part we're going to go over how to download an example pack, an example car model that we need to merge with our car and make it available to work in a game. But um, just a point continuing from the last video in 3D Max, I for forgot to mention one thing. Um, if you go to the selection from scene, most of the parts are linked together um, with parents. What you need to do is you need to unlink these. So select everything, just drag a box around the whole car. And press this button here. You need to unlink from the parents. It's um, when you export from the other program, the program just uh, links the part with the parents. So if you unlink them, they should be separated as this. Now we can just select these parts with the little type helper icon. We select them and delete them. Um, we don't really need them. And we're good to go after that. You just export it again as a 3ds file. So just accept and accept your 3ds file. Okay, this uh, this part four. Um, in part four, we need to download an example pack. Um, if you go to this website, Zmodeler2, this is the website for the program that can config the config the pro the car model and make it work in the game. So this program is pretty important. Um, right now, it's the price is lowered. You can get the program for twenty two US dollars. So you make your payment and a short time later they will send you the registration codes and instructions but uh, what we need to do is download an example pack so I'll show you what, what it is so you go to download and scroll down all the way to the bottom there's GTA examples and GTA example packs this one here is what we need GTA for, for examples and in this pack it's made by Oleg and there's um, it's got original GTA models and um, it's got a Vershare folder with textures and it should be a bike as well yeah it includes one vehicle and one bike so once you download that you sh this is what you should get so you unzip it and there should be a folder in this folder in this folder there is um, important textures these textures are inside the game but you need to have the right file name to use with your model so it's, it's got vehicle generic vehicle. Yeah, you need some of these um, maps so it your car will show up in the game so these are useful shaders to create shaders but in the example pack there is a car model right here so I'll just open that now so you should get this car right here so um, this car this car actually works in game if you go file export export that as a which file is that um, WTF here this file GTA 4 WTF file and you put that in the game and it will, it will work in the car so what this file is important because we're gonna remove the some parts from this car I'm gonna go over that in the video and merge our car into it um, the reason for that is because there's a lot of these dummies and um, rather than just making making them yourself it's a lot better to just um, use an existing one because uh, I've been trying to look for ways to make these dummies and it's it's just too complicated and it's too hard to find information so we just re we just reuse these dummies and they're pretty much the same on most cars and it will work for your car so we t need to remove um, move the dummies such as the lights the the player seats the back light where the door turns the wheels 
but um, yeah, just go ahead and download this model. And in the next video, we will have a look at um, merging our car with this car. And make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can get updates of more videos and show your support for the for my work. Thanks a lot. See you later, everybody.